What's up everybody out here at a boat ramp after work gonna get a little fishing in and I thought I'd take a minute to go over proper boat ramp manners and etiquette. Uh, so if you're new to kayak fishing, you may not even think of these things, but when you show up to a boat ramp, there's a right and wrong way to get your stuff in the water so you don't clog up the ramp for other boaters and other kayak anglers. So kayak anglers a lot of times will launch off the side of the road or at a dirt road or someplace that's not a ramp but sometimes that's not an option you're going to launch at a boat ramp where other people are going to be using it if it's on a weekend it's going to be busy so you don't want to clog this thing up so we're going to go over the don'ts first before we go over how you should properly get down this ramp so you guys can see my autopilot's on the trailer there i've got all my gear in the back of the vehicle and the, and the same thing would go whether you have a a trailer like mine like the Malone, or if you car top it on top of the car, or if you put this thing in the back of your truck and just truck bed it and slide it down in the water. The one thing you don't want to do, is you can see all the stuff in the back of my car there, you don't want to back down that ramp and then proceed to put all this gear on your kayak after you unload it down there, stand there and put your, your tackle crate in, your depth finder in, load your rods in. You don't want to do all that down there on the water Sometimes it can take five, 10 minutes to get your boat ready while people are waiting to get in, especially on the weekend or at a busy ramp. So the right way to do it is stage your boat up here in the parking lot, pull off away from the ramp, whether it's off the side of the road or this area has, they have a little, this isn't a parking area, it's kind of a little staging area where you can turn around or whatever. Get your boat ready here and then pull it down so that when you hit the water, you just throw it off and go and you're not clogging up the ramp for anybody. If you car top, you can take it off the car top, put it on the ground, get you a set of wheels like a Yak, uh, a yak Gear or Railblazer, a Sea Tug, or a Malone cart or whatever. Put your boat on wheels, stage it, roll it down manually. Or if your boat's in the back of the truck bed, you can just get it ready there and then pull down and slide it right out of your truck bed and into the water. Fully loaded at water's edge, just gotta take one strap off and throw it in. Let that take 10 seconds. Launch, got my boat out of the way. Now I'm gonna go park and I'm clear for the next person. So the same thing applies when you're done for the day. You can get it up on the trailer, fully loaded, put your front strap on, pull up out of the way and finish putting your stuff away instead of clogging the ramp up. All right, there you go guys. How to be, to be a decent human being at the boat ramp and have some good manners and keep that thing moving efficiently and quickly so others can get in the water and you're not holding everything up and, and being the bad guy at the ramp. Hope that helped y'all out. Thank y'all.